There goes Oregon. So that's definitely not going to be on the table. And Consulate not going to be repeat. Border again? Border again. All right. That'd be interesting. See how it goes down between these two. It would be interesting to see a bit more aggression on the attack than what we saw before. Yep. It was, uh, seemed to be struggling in that first matchup. Yep. So far, that's all three. So maybe that meta kind of swinging right on back to that. Although, to be fair, one of those was border before as well. Okay, one will find one. Quickly traded off by Nesk. Shut down one of those planters. Now it's a 3v2. Zig trying to spot, stop the whole thing. A sexy cake. Shotgun in hand. He'll find the kill. Drops the diffuser on the floor. Advantage now in the hands of Team Liquid on the defense. See the smoke. Has face planted in Zig. Will be called in. No, his... Uh, Yokai have already been set, and Sexy Cake will find one and two. There you go. Sexy Cake. Gohan setting up, and he's going to go for the run. He'll get the kill and at least drop one, and he'll be detected. Now, Revolt's taking him out with Stata to bring her teammates back to life. And this is the. Oh, FK1. Well done there on Nesk. But that would be good for them to bring this back for the last 40 seconds. Yeah, the hatch has already been opened up, and Paolo will find the kill on FK1. Still has Yokai's to use, and that diffuser is on the floor. Pain will have to fight up, but GCR will get Paulo, so no more yo guys. I was just mentioning it. XK will try to roll long arm it there. Oh, oh no, no! The sight! He finds the kill! GCR has been taken down. Where is Revolt? He's gonna try to find the angle. He can't find it! No! Not like this! Sexy Cake! He turns. Oh no, he had it! Why did you get off of it? You go again! Is this oh no. Not like this. What Revolt's a throw! Revolt's on down, and he gets taken out. Is there enough time? Sexy Cake will try to stick it. He's gonna Three, call four, What? Did what are you doing? All right. Oh! <laughs> All right. Just what a mistake that was. Unfortunate, but Paulo's gonna be able to refrag though. Can he use a hatch to drop down? It's not gonna matter. Revolt takes a bit of damage, but takes down Apollo. Half drop from the hatch and move in from the front side. A Nest will find one and the two with a hatch shot. Capitos will go down and not much time left. Recover the diffuser defense of Team Liquid. Dropping from below. Ooh, that's two nitros down there that's then. two nitros. They what are you, what? Gabrielos just vaults right in with no information on Gohan in the back. The second one will move in and an instant flip from Gohan to shut down revolts. One more moving in by the Armory Balcony. FK1 will find Gohan finally, but oh man, Palu, no, what are you doing? DCR will get one on Palu, but not for long. Nesk will get the cleanup and Sexy Kick from below will deny spawns with the C4. No time left as the attacker will have to get off his drone. That was the buck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you see Jaeger often hanging out. He just oh. completely thwarts that. Only one kill done there, but at least he takes down FK1. Unfortunately, that's the Ash. Not a huge operator for the attack instead of to Ooh. lose. Ooh, nice. The sledge would have been much better kill, and unfortunately, that did not work. Shotgun in hand and can't do much against the supernova. That's it right there. The diffuser's too far away. Five seconds left on the clock, and Goomine's galore here being set up. They'll do more damage. DCR will find Zig. Nesk on the floor here, dropping like it's hot. Hot and that's the round that Liquid needed. All the advantage. Slowly that direction, especially after that move by Gohan. Yeah, great play here, and Spawns will try to move in. He'll spot the body on the side, but Palu turns around to get one and two, one revolts. Gabriel's last man alive here in the gym. It's definitely not an odd thing to see, well, at least after, there you go, Palu will finish things off. Great play by the Mute Apollo in this round. Yeah, a lot of kills from at least three. Mm -hmm. So pretty sick shots up in CCTV. And the last one there, pretty predictable. You know the is tased, and he's gonna get shot from below, just being harassed endlessly by the Twitch. <laughs> there you go. I was gonna say it's a little bit of waste in the sense that he can just heal himself up. But to do that, but the smoke is gonna be very deadly if Sexy Cake wishes to move up, but go on in a perfect position. The armory window, get one kill, spawns alive here, but no C4, and Gabriel's in the back, and he'll get pushed up by, no, that's the wrong one, grenade shoved in, but Paulo will find the kill, and a fuser has been planted, Gabriel's up against the nigh impossible task, will get shot down, and Paulo to take him out. Team Liquid, efficient and effective gameplay, one round away yep. from a total victory. That match point there almost, could have let him. He's got a reinforced wall as well to be very careful behind. He'll win the gunfight and the duel against Gabrielos. Not against GCR, however. The Monty's still in front. The well, important thing is the smoke's down, and that was going to be the biggest rival to Monty. Yeah, the nuclear deterrent, basically. It's still the goo mines of Legion in place. So Sexy Kick has to be very careful to not take much damage before he pushes him, and that's what they wanted. Now FK1 has been taken down. Sexy Kick takes a lot of damage, but 
more than enough to take down G. What he wants to do really here is just to stand right in front of the Mon or right in front of the Pulse. He gets shot from the from the back. Okay. It's one kill though from Paulo. Spawns will find one, but not for long. Paulo will find the last two on the Twitch. We'll end it all right then and there. Round number eight will go the way of Team Liquid, and that's 7 1. Uh, it's definitely uh, over. And then, of course, was able to help with the plant attempt.